All right, how to make a backrooms video. Go to blender.org, download Blender, install it, open it up. Delete your default cube and add in a plane. Duplicate the plane, make it higher. Enter the shading tab, find a ceiling texture. Plug in the texture to the base color. If it looks too big, don't worry, head into the UV tab and scale it up. Do the same thing with the bottom, but instead use a carpet texture. Add in a new cube and fit it into the two planes. If you want wall bases, you can do Control R, click, pull it down, select those, extrude, maybe bevel. If you don't care about polygon count, you can change it to a custom profile. Create two textures, assign one to the wall bases and one to the walls. Then head back to the shading tab, add your wallpaper texture, head back to UV editing, scale and rotate it to your liking, hide your ceiling for now, and build out your scene. If you want different objects like thin walls or poles, just scale down the original cube and fix UV. Next, add in a torus, make it low poly. This is going to be our light source. Double click to select the top, click F, make two different textures and assign them to the middle and the outside. Make the middle texture bright, switch to cycles, use GPU for non-denoising, use the array mod fire on your light source. Find where you want your camera and hit Control alt numpad 0. Grab the camera shake v2 add-on. Edit preferences. Install the add-on. You should have the add-on down here on the camera. Select walk to the store. Animate your movement with auto keyframing. Change your samples. Higher is better quality but slower. Hit Control f12 and let it render for a bit. And now you have backroom 